With the number of coronavirus cases rising in Indiana, I want to take a moment to thank the hardworking men and women who are on the front lines of this fight. Doctors, nurses, physician assistants, lab techs, administrators, and so many other healthcare workers are working day and night to care for our fellow Hoosiers and keeping our community safe and healthy. I also want to thank those who continue to provide essential services from grocery workers and truck and delivery drivers to manufacturers helping fill gaps and meet vital needs. Our communities depend on you and we're grateful for all you do. The next few weeks are absolutely critical and by coming together now, we can slow the spread of coronavirus and save lives. We all have to do our part by practicing social distancing, staying home from work except for essential, and activities and maintaining good hygiene such as frequent hand washing. I know these are challenging days, but it's days like this when Hoosiers pull together to support their neighbors. I can assure you our federal, state, and local officials are working together seamlessly to make sure our communities have the resources they need. I've been in close contact with our public health authorities in every county of the second district, including the St. Joseph County Unified Command. We've been able to secure personal protection equipment for healthcare workers from the strategic national stockpile and will continue working to make sure our hospitals and healthcare facilities are fully prepared. We're also focused on the toll this historic crisis is taking on working families. Right now, Congress and the Trump administration are working on a major stimulus bill that will provide immediate relief to workers, families, and small businesses. I'm in close contact with my colleagues as we work to get this done for the American people. For the latest information, please visit walorski.house.gov coronavirus.